Welcome to the official BMW IBU World Cup press conference after the main relay. First place, Team Norway with Johannes Dahle, Ellen Biotekar, Tarje Bo, Johannes Tinez Bo. Second place, Team France, Emilian Jacqueline and Simone Dittio. And third place, uh, represented by Team Italy, Lucas Hofer and Thomas Bermolini. Johannes, um, you literally jumped into today's competition, starting very fast and uh, keeping the speed during the whole leg. Entering the relay, um, you're first at the World Cup level. Uh, did you feel any pressure and how satisfied are you with this debut? Yeah, I was uh, very calm until I woke up this morning and then I was starting to feel the pressure a bit. <coughs> but uh, nothing too bad. And when I started to race, it was, it was okay. But... Uh, and the last, uh, the standing shooting was a bit shaky, uh, but I also expected that. Uh, but I think I, uh, I uh, do my job in a in a good way, uh, and I'm uh, and I'm happy. Thank you. Congratulations, <coughs> Ellen. You moved your team from fifth to second place. Um, tell a little bit about the conditions at the shooting range because it seemed that a lot of um, athletes missed at the second leg. Yes, uh, especially the first prone was uh, very difficult. Uh, w the wind was turning uh, w first to the right and uh, after to the to the left, or yeah, maybe it was opposite. But uh, it was very hard to uh, to to read or to to manage the situation. But uh, yeah, I I think I managed it quite all, all right, and that uh, gave me a good advantage for the rest of the race. Thank you, congratulations. Tari, you had a great performance today, uh, giving your brother leading position and making up 20 seconds on the rest of the field. Is that what you expected from yourself today? Uh, no, <coughs> not at all. Or, yeah, I, I, I've been felt strong this week, but still, uh, uh, you never know. Uh, we, we knew that especially France would be, be hard, uh, hard guys for today, and we know they had extremely good race on uh, Wednesday also so um, yeah I knew it was would be f a hard fight with Simon and uh, yeah we followed each other the whole race uh, but luckily I got a little gap so Johannes could uh, cruise on the last leg thank you congratulations um, Johannes after not the strongest individual competition uh, you looked really confident today um, how did you set up for this competition especially entering it with Morton just behind you yeah, I think uh, before the race I thought uh, the biggest challengers should be uh, Team France after what they have shown this week and uh, yeah, they were second uh, behind Tarja in the exchange so uh, I just had to start with a good pace and try to keep them behind. Thank you, congratulations. Emilian, um, that is the best week at the World Cup level for you so far, and as well, it's really great for the uh, French team. How did you feel entering this competition with uh, such strong teammates? Yeah, it was not the first time I compete with Simon Quentin and Martin for a relay. Um, I did it one year ago in Repolding, so it was a lot of pressure one year ago. And it was the same uh, this morning. Uh, of course, we we made a pretty gone, pretty strong week, and we all wanted to to be able to to win today. But um, as a lot of times, uh, there is a strong Norwegian team uh, against us, and uh, I think for my part, uh, I make my job. Uh, I work hard on the skis. It was harder than the other days, and on shooting, it was good. So. Yeah, we are so gone, but I think we are all proud of uh, what we did today. Thank you, congratulations. Simon, uh, just a few days ago, French team um, had perfect competition with four top places. <laughs> Nevertheless, today, not everything worked perfect. What changed? <laughs> it's, uh, it's not the same uh, races in between uh, relay and, uh, and individual. We arrived today with a lot of confidence, but uh, all all by athlete knows that uh, uh, nothing uh, nothing uh, is um, is making before before the race. And uh, no no way was uh, very strong today, like uh, always in the relay. So congrats to 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 Norway today and. Uh, 
It's always a big uh, fight uh, in Relay, so we are happy to be second today. Thank you, congratulations. Um, Lucas, first leg in Relay uh, is always strategically a little bit different from the rest of the competition. How did you set up for today's competition and what tactics did you have in your mind? Uh, the first leg is always difficult because you know that all of them uh, try to push as hard as possible and uh, the first leg gets always even faster uh, like in the last years <laughs> and normally I'm not the, the right one for this one but uh, it makes fun to, to be also sometimes in the first one. Thank you, congratulations. Thomas, great performance from uh, your team today. Um, where you use only eight spares, using like being the most accurate team uh, squad today. Uh, what is the secret of such great shooting, and especially uh, at this windy shooting range? I, I don't tell you the the secret. Uh, anyway, <laughs> uh, I think uh, we did a great job, and we tried to to be calm on the shooting range. And the wind was uh, strange today, but. Uh, like a team, we did a really good job. Thank you so much. Congratulations. Do we have any other questions? No? Thank you.